so this is a artifacty deck that we're going to be able to see uh, Sahili, Tezzeret, and Ugin. And we got some Traxos too. So we're going to try to make things as cheap as possible, put a bunch of artifacts into play, draw some cards with them, and uh, and that's what we're going to do. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna be back in just a second, but we'll hit play. Perfect timing. Okay. Well, I think this is just what this deck looks like, so we're going to keep it. The end game should be the end game. Quite possibly. And now it will be. Oh, yeah. Karn's Bastion. Got four of these in here. Do we need four? No. We're going to play for yes. Mount of Walkers and Proliferate seems like EDH is going to be a dangerous place to be. <laughs> Probably. Probably so. Um... I don't think Planeswalkers, like, in small doses, are good in Commander. I think Super Friends decks can be good. I like when they're a little more themed than just, like, here's a bunch of good Planeswalkers. What an interesting creature. What an interesting creature. Okay. So, we're going to be able to play Joyra's Familiar next turn. Windgrace is a very good place to be. Yeah, I don't. I think that that Planeswalkers generally are not too powerful in Commander. I think like Atraxa can be annoying because you're proliferating and you're kind of inherently breaking the rules of Planeswalkers. But if you're just playing them squarely, then it's just whatever. You know, one one v one, they're very good. But in 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 a legitimate multiplayer game, then they're you know it's whatever. Okay. Play this relic. And pass. Deploy. Okay. Yeah, it resolves. Yeah, it res resolves. Thank you. Okay. Yes. Sure. Killing the owner does remove all the planeswalkers. That is true. Always been true. Will continue to be true. This Tezzeret is very sweet. All right, so if our opponent doesn't have a counter spell, big if. But if our opponent doesn't have a counter spell, we're gonna essentially be able to play our whole hand next turn. Now, I don't know that that's the case. I really hope it is.
No, there's no way. There's just no way. All right. Oh, we need to draw a land anyway, which we did not. Had we drawn a land, we could play familiar into familiar Traxos Ugin. I take what I need. Well, resolved. That is awesome. Sound of your demise. Oh my god. That has to be the absolute coolest ability to, uh, of, of any Planeswalker that we've played today. Don't kill Tezzeret, come on. You missed it, dude, again? <laughs> I mean, if, they, if Tezzeret doesn't die... Well, Tezzeret's not going to die. Remember what you were saying about uh, removing planeswalkers? Rem removing people removes planeswalkers from the game? Well, we just got removed from the game. We're going to do it again. Don't worry. Man. Oh, if we'd only drawn a land that last turn. If we'd drawn a land that last turn, we were going to do the thing. The whole thing. Card Kingdom. Do fun things and opponent punishes us. Yeah. That's true. We'll keep this one. Alright, we have two Power Stone Shards. That's good. That's good and fun. Do, I think we just wait for Sahili to try to play this the the Guild Globe. Okay. Okay, it gets a plus one plus one counter. That's fine. As long as we don't just lose. Okay. My creations are things of beauty. Okay. Come on, Mowu. Can't he your best self? Where's Mowu? Whoa, Mowu. -wo that wasn't very inventive. Okay. And pass. Okay. Next turn, we should be able to do more, obviously. I always have some disgusting things with mana doubling. Yeah, for sure. Okay. This doesn't have trample or anything, so we're going to block. All right, man. Krasis, okay. So Krasis is gonna take down Sahili next turn. Two, three, Power Stone Shard, and Antiquities War. Resolve. Let's get another Power Stone Shard. Yeah. Okay. 
We could kill Sahili to play, but I would rather them just, you know, let it let it happen. We could minus, uh, turn this servo. Not this one. Oh no, they were both summoning sick. Never mind. Could not have done that. Wait, it just turns it into it, so it's not a creature anymore? Except it's an artifact? Okay, so we could have done that. Could have, probably should have. Either way, we're going to play Ugin next turn. No blocks. Opponent's also Karn's Bastion stuff. Okay. Crisis. All right. It's big Crisis. Let's get the globe. Draws us a little further into our deck. Okay. Power Stone Shard. Ugin. I am ancient and wise. Heed my advice. Oh, I hate his voice. Just hate it. Just hate everything about it. Hmm. Play another Antiquities War. I think we just play Traxxas, though. Artifacts become 5-5. Five, five. This gets smaller. Let's Antiquities War. See what we can find. Sky Scanner. All right. Guild Globe. Guild Globe. Um, pay to or Ozka Relic. Uh, tap. Sky Scanner. Land. And then let's just get one of these. Attack you. Uh, we'll attack you both. <laughs> Heed my advice. Oh, by the way, our opponent's going to be super dead next turn. Super de duperty dead. Yeah, just casually just put like 10 artifacts into play that turn. They're looking, they're like, what are we going to do? I don't know. But it's going to happen again the next turn, too, so. So you better figure it out. He kills Uga, and then he realizes the beats are coming. Yeah. Breeding pull, sure. The beats are coming. The voice may wish Ugin also got put in the prison zone. Yeah, no kidding. That was awful. Man. How does Bolas sound so awesome? Ugin sounds like an old man. You know what? No wonder Jace doesn't want to listen to him. He's like, ah, shut up, Ugin. Nobody cares about your crap. Another time, planeswalker. Another time. Sure, sure thing. Proliferate? I can respect it. So you see, they're trying to proliferate this up to turn these uh, into five fives now, but now it's just going to happen again. 
That was clever. That was clever. Uh, oh, come on. Let me just attack you. We did it, though. We did that. We did do that thing. Could have done it last time with Tezzeret. She went ham on him, but... The Tezzeret animation was dope. We're going to see it again. Don't worry. Uh, Bolus is one less... I think is just barely younger than Hugin. Okay. They're, they're twins. I think Bolus is technically the youngest. Bolus sounds about sounds the same because he uses mind magic to make you think he sounds as cool as possible. He probably does do that. That is a very Bolus thing to do. You're right. They're the same age. I mean, they're like, you know, because twins, there's always one that's born first. I think if you want to get technical, um, Ugin was born first, but I mean, yeah, it's irrelevant. Bullets having a stutter make everyone think he doesn't. Let's let's just play Traxos. Traxos is big, right? Big old Traxos. Right. Traxos got mortified. Okay. You just gave me an idea. You just gave me an idea for Joyrus Familiar. This one is looking a little rough. Okay, hero. We have another mortify. Judy. Okay. Can respect. Can respect Judy. Thinks the Healy's probably going down this turn. Ooh, could have Sahili not go down. Trade with this hero, go to one. However, we know that Sahili's not very good right now. Our hand is not very good with Sahili, so. So we could play this for three, then these both for one. That sounds pretty good. One. One. There's Tez. So we can play the other familiar and Ugin or Tezzeret next turn, which is pretty sweet. However, what our opponent's doing to us right now is not very sweet. We need, like, an all is dust. Um, two, three, four. Sixteen. Whatever. Let's just see what we can do on our turn. I think we're going to lose this game. We know this deck is good. The deck our opponent's playing. So... Um, so close to being able to just play Ugin also. Oh, we can. We can also play Ugin. Okay. Yeah. Ugin's, Ugin is zero because it gets reduced from Tezzeret and being historic. So... Plus... Oh my gosh. He just goes on and on, doesn't he? That's the animation. My artifacts give them strength. By the way, that's the animation. My plans do not include you. Now he's probably gonna kill Ugin. Kill Ugin. Don't don't get that sky scanner. Rats. 
Yes. Okay. He's gonna talk some more. Oh, it's too late. Okay, so we get a guild globe when this dies. No attacks. Oh, and more Judy's. Judy is a problem. Okay. Oh, you're going to kill the sky scanner with the Judy trigger? Two Judy triggers. Okay. So we're dead though, but we were close. We were close. Seven. I mean, we're super dead. I think. I think this deck is something. Like, we obviously lost that one, but... Did you think to play one new Karn and then the five-drop artifact creature in the board to do the combo? No, I don't have any Karns. I didn't, I didn't put any Karns in this deck. The combo you um, pick... I mean, what is that... What are we doing with that, though? Like, the... You're talking about the... The uh, Dominary card, the 4-4 four, for four, 5. Alright, this seems fine. There's, there's our boy. Dr. Tez. Play the old Guild Globe, okay. Ooh, our opponent's doing a little artifacty stuff too. Okay. Can can respect. Can definitely respect. Mox Amber. I probably should have a Mox Amber in this deck. Yeah, I should definitely have Mox Amber in this deck. I just forgot about it. Fountain of Renewal. Yeah, our opponent's kind of doing a similar thing. Okay, so I'm gonna play Tez next turn. Relic Sky the Sky Scanner we can play for free next turn though. Off of off of Tez's ability. No, no, no. Ah. Oh. That is not what we wanted at all. Man. All right, well, there's Ugin at least. Hopelessness oh God. Are the sea he just, he just, uh, he's just uh, all this. Another Ugin. Um, let's pass the turn. Okay, so Karn... So, are you talking about the Dominary card? Like, I do not remember the name of it, to be honest. Sun in the sky, on my skin. 
The four four for five that you lets you return a historic permanent. That one. Okay, so let's get here. I think it takes four. That's fine. Uh, let's go to our turn. More Ugins. Okay. Plus. Okay, there's a Sahili. Let's draw. Okay, another globe. Play the globe. Joy was familiar, which means Uga we could play for three. Okay. We'll play another Ugin. Yeah, well, I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm sure I want to hear him talk. I'm sure that you do. I'm sure that you know more. I'm sure you just know everything. Secrets no attacks. All right. Karn, the great creator. Yes, Dominary Historic Permanent Card. That's the one. Grab one from the board. Bounce Karn. Repeat. The ocean surges life. Oh no, they got a Tezzeret. They got a grabby hand. <laughs> I don't want them to have a grabby hand. Oh, well. I guess I can just get rid of Tez here. Alright. Draw a card. It's a Healy. That's pretty good. My creations are things of beauty. Let's draw another card. Honor Grave. We'll play that tapped. And pass. Presumably they can kill Ugin. Thought a Razor. Ha ha. Just an island. For now, I have two Vorthos questions. Yes. Get at me. Okay. Can't beat it. Can't beat the value. Alright. Let's... Let's make sure that all of these cards are pulling their weight. Blink of an eye, this is for um, Immortal Sun. Guild Globe, yeah. Sahili, yes, yes, yes. We just need a bunch of artifacts. Traxos, probably unnecessary after seeing the deck in action. All right. So we're talking about Karn the Great Creator. Okay. And let's find some artifacts for the sideboard. What does this do? Creatures can't be blocked this turn. That's kind of cute. Chamber Sentry, we can make a lot of mana. Silent Gravestone, sure, why not? Um, I 
I don't even know. What do I even put in here? Put in the sideboard. Sorcerer Spyglass. Treasure Map. Urza's Tome. Chaos Wand. Magistrate Scepter. Transmorgifying Wand. Conqueror's Galleon. Helm of the Host. Icy Manipulator. Petraxos in there. Guardians of Coilos. I'll put two of those in there so we can get both if needed to try to do some nonsense. And the Immortal Sun, why not? In okay, case so there's a situation where we need to do that. Okay. Oh, size on artifact. Yeah, let's add one psi. Just a single psi. And then we'll take out one bastion for a mox amber. Okay. Going again. Alright. So. On a scale of 1 to 10, how, how happy are you that Lily survived War of the Spark? 10. Easy. Next question. Um, this seems fine. We have some draw and some ramp. Alright. How mentally messed up do you think she'll be that Gideon died to pay her, pay her debt? Probably pretty messed up. Like, I think Liliana is a much deeper character than a lot of people give her credit for. Like, she's not necessarily been a good person, but she also knows that, and she's kind of embraced it. But she's not, like, inherently evil. She has just made a lot of... What is this? I need to block this. This is good against me. <laughs> Man, really? Who is playing this Lavinia? Whatever your plans, um, statistically likely but I, I think that I think that Liliana is less of a oh man, this is just this is some prison deck. This is some BS. All right. Well, we're probably going to lose to this combo, which I didn't obviously didn't expect to see. Um, smothering tide. All right. Anyway, I don't. I was going on about about Lily. No blocks, I guess. Okay, resolve, decline, not paying, not paying your debts. Let's play a Power Stone Shard. Uh, no attacks. Did anyone else kick the bucket besides Gids? Well, we believe that Dak and Domri did. That seems pretty clear from the trailer and the cards in the set. Citadel is an artifact as well. You're looking colorless. Yeah, but we can't cast Citadel. I don't have um, Chromatic Lantern in the deck. Uh, she does care about her actions feel like she does it even when deep shown down she does. Yeah, for sure. Decline. 
Decline. Maybe we just play the Antiquities War. We get another token to protect Sahili. I'll get a globe. A globe that we can't play because of scumbag this team. Team scumbag over here. Alright, Smothering Tide, you got it. Resolve all. Decline. Let's get this Power Stone Shard. Yep. Okay. So annoying. We can't even cast this. That's just like infuriating. Man, this deck is really annoying that our opponent's playing. Like, super duper annoying. Fortunately, we might be able to teach them a lesson. Globals will draw us a card, but we won't be able to play anything off of it, so... So be it. The one person sh she couldn't bring back was the one person who gave up everything to save her. Yeah. She, and she cares for Gideon. I mean, that much is definitely true. Dak was not in the set, but Dak is in the story. Dak is apparently a very important part of the story. This card. So annoying. Okay. Just in case this dies. Resolve, decline, decline. Can finally play Ugin. Two, four. Five. Absorb, sure. All right. Well, now I'm going to attack you. You, opponent. Thorn in my side with your Azorius nonsense. This better not be settled. Oh, my God. Get five. Oh, man. God, fair statue. This deck is a nightmare. What a nightmare this deck has to play against. Uh, it's just, just, it's just not, it's just no fun. I can't even click these things right. I can't even answer your questions. 
because it's so miserable. I'm, get, I'm getting to it, game. Just give me a second. Standard Grand Arbiter, this is my worst nightmare. I hate it so much. So, so much. Okay, so this makes 9, 10, 10 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, so I can at least cast both of these. This only costs 3 to do. Instant sorcery. During your turn. Ability. Okay. Okay, I think I want to... Activate this. Activate this. Yeah, because I can still... Three... Okay, okay, I can still play this next turn. Okay. I'm going to get Dovin just because I'm tired of his face. Real tired of his face. Don't settle the wreckage, me. I swear to God. Sure. Yep, they're not in there. Still not in there. All right. They're running out of cards, though. They got all the mana in the world, but they're running out of cards. Hmm. I think I can get the Sky Scanner, actually. 18, do I have 18, 9, 10, I have exactly 18, 19, okay, I'll get the Sky Scanner, I'll just play these next turn. Tough free time, whatever. I am not going to sit this one out. I'll protect you. Yep. The wind kind of is annoying opponent into b oblivion. I'm not going to give up. If I would just draw a desert, I could just... This would... Hey, look at that. <laughs> we did it. Make this go a little faster. Sure. Okay. So... I play this first, and then these have affinity, so I can just pl essentially play them for free. Wait. But then if I pay zero, it gets countered? That's so dumb. That's moronic. Yeah, and it would be zero, because they'd be affinity down to zero. Yes, you can have your tithe. Go ahead. Okay. Um, so this is eight. So five. This will cost seven. So do I have 14? I don't think so. Three, four, ten. I have thirteen, of course. All right. Put it better not have a counter spell. Okay, I was about to say. Yeah. So now they get now these get countered 
from um from Lavinia. We're just gonna laser blast him. Laser blast our opponent until they're dead. No attacks. Actually, one, two, three. Yeah, that'll do. One, two, three. Let's get that stupid thing dead. We will okay. In the turn. Yeah, you you're you have nothing. You have nothing, opponent. You have nothing. Give up. Built two and dealt by target permanent. So that's Tezzeret. Sure. You're still gonna get Antiquities Ward. Oh lord. Oh my god. This is my nightmare. This is my nightmare. Thought we had ground our opponent out of cards, and yet here we stand. Yep. Okay. Well, I'm glad they didn't do, uh, in ourselves. Glad they didn't do Tezzeret there. That would have been, been bad for us. Yep. Lose one. Got it. My turn. Draw. Hey, look. Resolve. Yeah, I'm going to pay this time. I'm not going to get any more mana. They're going to have one mana to work with. Yeah, you're at two now. This should strike fear into you. We have one mana. Attack huh. with all. Okay. Oh my gosh. This deck. Hate everything about it. One, two, three, four, five. All I gotta do is hit him with one of these. Five attackers. Pay five. One, two, three, four, five. Please be dead. Are you, are you gonna go block? You're gonna block all these creatures? This is what you're doing? Deserved. Well deserved. We got him the laser hand. That is true justice. That is the truest, the truest of all justice. That win. So what were we talking about before, before that? Yeah, what were we talking about before that? Good time to remind you. The Wizards of the Coast is sponsoring this stream. Gave me the sweet account for free, which is great. So we can play with all of these cards, because I definitely don't have all these cards on my regular account. Might make this deck, though. This seems pretty great. Okay. Whew. We go first. Um, 
I think this... We need one more land. Whatever. We're riding high. We're riding high. So when Borg and us left Gruul was in search of the raised boar, and then when the raised boar came back and be riding on it like a badass, that's, that would be great. That would definitely be great. Uh, Lily's mind post war the spark. Uh, I think she's going to be a, a pretty dramatically different person. I imagine they get Sahili here. Opponent does. Oh, gets uh, old blinky blink of an eye. All right, we didn't draw land. Shoot them all again. We're riding high off that 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 win that we worked so hard to get. We're gonna discard two. Let's discard Ugin and a Sky Sahili. Okay. Might not matter. I don't know. I, I hope they don't make a white lily on it either. I really hope that she stays black. Okay. So we're probably going to get Power Stone Shard. Yeah. Davril? Okay. Yeah, we're gonna lose this one, but that's okay. I'm bored already. I don't think you'll be needing that. Davril's great. Alright. Antiquities War. If we can get Antiquities War going, then, you know, maybe we'll... Maybe we'll be able to do something. Who knows? Empty your mind. Nice. We're super dead. I know you mentioned a theory about Garrick on Think Twice. I'd love him to be the next villain. I still believe he's going to be. have thought that for like three years. Since the beginning, at, le at minimum since the beginning of our of our show. Uh, instead of the multiverse of stake, which gets paid out. Having a bad man that just hates walkers is a cool nemesis for the gate watch and should be a cool story. I definitely agree with that. Oh, we're dead. We're super dead in here, by the way. Burglar rat. Thief of Sanity. Now that was last match. Opponent was able to steal our sanity without even casting Thief of Sanity. All I've left you is pain. That's true. You know, block with your little burglar rat? Yeah. Garrick going after Liliana forever? Probably. Lily, yeah. Garrick is not a happy person. There's so many planes. So Garrick could have a, a base on a plane that despises walkers. Takes walkers there to execute them. The Gatewatch has to intervene and fight fight a villain rather than the end of the world. That would be nice, wouldn't it? I feel like this is a land and our opponent's going to flip, flip Bolus and get us real good. Garrett kept killing low end walkers. Loneliness can hurt. All right. We're dead. Maybe we can kill Davril on our way out. Yes. I have some fine print to obfuscate. Garrick vs. V. Angrath. That would be sweet. That'd be a sweet battle. All right, let's, uh, I don't, I don't want you to suggest anything. All right, 
One more with Bridge Masters. We have been able to do our thing with this deck, which is good. Well, but one more with Bridge Masters, then we're going to go on to the final deck, which is the uh, the big end game. Yeah, I don't think Garrick's going to care much if Liliana is reformed. I think that she is. Um, Liliana's not going to get less intelligent too. Like she knows, she's not going to assume that people have changed around her just because she's changed. I think is a good way to look at it. All right, this seems fine. A little slow, but. There's our Karn. Let's see if we can get uh, this Jorah's Familiar stick. As unlikely as that seems. The district is mobilized. Might further mess with Lily if she has neg negative issues after getting... I mean, I'm sure she's going to have some issues for sure. Lily's Triumph? Sure. That's fine. Means there's Liliana, the Liliana lurking. Um, let's get rid of this Tezzeret. Let's play Karn. I have faced worse than the likes of you. I have faced worse than the likes of you. That's true. Okay. Wish we had put something in here to get us a hit on mana. But we didn't do that. We did not do that at all. You know what? Let's get this, because we know that Liliana's going to be in this deck. Don't want to get that spyglass. We can play Jorius Familiar into the spyglass next turn. Alright, Topher, thank you. Yes, yeah, definitely definitely come back around 8 o'clock for Ollie v. Justin, round 2. And the start of a new series. Every Tuesday. Yeah, map would get ahead on mana. Um, I'm going to play this Spyglass because I feel like our opponent has Liliana in their deck if they're having, if they're playing that card. And that is a card that I believe will be very difficult for us to defeat. And as such, ah, look what we found. Liliana, Dreadhorde General. Right on time. Right on time. Would have got us. Could have got us real good. Cry the Carnarium? Sure. Sure thing. Let's play a Skyscanner to draw a card. Let's play a Guild Globe to draw a card. Can play Ugin next turn. Oh, I was going to chill on our opponent's hand. Burglar Rats. Uh, let's get rid of the 
Okay, so if we play Tez, you know, we gotta get rid of the relic. Unfortunately. We'll lose two, that's fine. All right, play Tez. Sky Scanner is free. Not cross me. Familiar's free. Ugin's now free. Oh, that's good stuff. This is this is just good, solid living. Is what this is. Man, what a turn. What a turn this is. The Eldest Reborn. I will sacrifice Sky Scanner. We'll play this for free. Play the Antiquities War for three. And get a another sky scanner. Yeah, sure, why not? Another sky scanner. Play a lance, so we don't discard. Exile the top, which is blink of an eye. Let's zap our opponent in the face. More power. Uh, this costs two to do. All right, let's get on in there. Let's get on in there. I love that Tesla's belly has an animation. A little balloon animally? <laughs> That's just not nice. Static shock of doom. Yeah, I think that's more what it is. Ritual of soot. No problem. Still gonna get zapped. Gonna get zapped real good. Get the relic. Relic. Globe. Draw a card. Globe, draw a card. Land. Zap for the finish. Good stuff. Oh, it's good stuff. Man, Tez is sweet. All right. Last deck. 